All right, there, everyone. I'm meteorologist Ashley Baylor with a check of your latest forecast. As we continue through this evening, the chance of seeing any more showers or thunderstorms will actually start to diminish overnight. Well, partly cloudy skies, so a little bit of cloud cover kicking off your Sunday morning. But just like we saw today, even though we'll start with a few clouds, we'll see a nice mix of sun and clouds going through the latter half of the morning into the middle of the day. But after three o'clock, we do run the risk of seeing an isolated shower or thunderstorm. Looks like most of us will stay dry, though, so not a huge deal for Sunday. Keep your outdoor plans as we go from Sunday night into Monday morning. We'll have mainly clear skies. And right now we're looking at a decent amount of sunshine on Labor Day. Let's take a quick check of the tropics, though. We are tracking this tropical wave that is over Turks and Caicos right now. And it looks like it's going to move over the Bahamas and essentially cross over Florida into the Gulf of Mexico. So over the next five days, it has a 40% chance of developing either into a tropical depression, maybe even a tropical storm. So it is going to be worth watching, even though it's not really going to affect us here in Hampton Roads. We also keep an eye on tropical storm Florence. It actually is some really nice nice spin to it. Winds are now up to 45 miles per hour as it continues west-northwest at 16 miles per hour. So as we put a track on this for you, it is expected to remain a tropical storm all the way through Labor Day. You can see winds picking up to 65 miles per hour. And at this point, the National Hurricane Center does keep this a tropical storm, even heading into much of next week. But I would not rule out the possibility of it gaining strength into a Category 1 hurricane as it continues into the Atlantic. Right now, it's expected to remain just a fish storm, but anything that starts to inch close to the U.S., we always have to keep an eye on. So thunder showers just early tonight, otherwise partly cloudy temperatures falling to 73 degrees. And then tomorrow, sun and clouds, 2 in 10 chance of an isolated shower. Not a huge deal. We're dry for Labor Day and we're dry for the first day of school on Tuesday. Lots of sunshine, temperatures near 90 degrees.